everyone has heard of superheroes. Some have superpowers that allow them to lift cars and run at top speeds. Did you know that ordinary people sometimes seem to have superpowers? When people do seemingly impossible physical feats, it can be attributed to the hormone adrenaline that is released in the body at times of high stress or excitement. Adrenaline is part of the acute stress response system. First, your body sees or hears the situation and response nerves are sent to your brain. The nerves contact your endocrine system, which contains all of your hormonal organs. The hypothalamus, which is like the brain of the endocrine system, tells the adrenal gland to release adrenaline, which also helps convert the body's fuel source, glycogen, into its fuel, glucose. When adrenaline is released into the adrenal medulla, which is located just above your kidneys, it allows adrenaline to flow to the heart, causing it to beat faster. The adrenaline contracts the blood vessels and dilates or expands the air passages. This increases blood flow to your muscles and increases oxygen flow to the lungs. This rise in flow allows the muscles to work harder and your lungs to give you more air to run fast and lift heavy objects. This process is sometimes known as an adrenaline rush. During an adrenaline rush, your awareness levels will rise and you will breathe more frequently. Even after a rush, you might feel dizzy or lightheaded. Your vision can also be fuzzy and distorted. A person may also feel restless after a rush because lots of glucose has been released into the body, giving the body too much energy that it knows what to do with. Some people even intentionally indulge in high-risk activities or sports, such as skydiving or cliff jumping, to feel an adrenaline rush. These exciting sports trigger the adrenal glands and give people the extra physical boost they need. It's amazing what our bodies can do in moments of stress. Our body knows exactly how to respond and gives you what it needs. Sometimes it seems that adrenaline gives us extreme abilities, but it isn't superpowers at work, it's super science.